How do you approach severe obesity in adolescents at your institution? Hi, I'm Cecilia Gijena from Cincinnati Children's Hospital, and I think that this is an article that you should know about. This is a multicenter randomized control trial done in Sweden. Their aim was to evaluate the changes in the body mass index after metabolic and bariatric surgery or after intensive non-surgical treatment. And what did they find? They had 50 patients, 25 underwent a surgery and 25 underwent intensive non-surgical treatment. After two years, the surgical group decreased their body mass index 12.5 kilograms per square meter, whereas the intensive non-surgical treatment only decreased it by 0.2 kilograms per square meter. Four surgical patients had mild complications, including one cholecystectomy. Also, the surgical group had a reduction in the bone mineral density, while the non-surgery group didn't. So, it seems that metabolic bariatric surgery an effective, well-tolerated treatment for adolescents with severe obesity. Let us know what you think and stay tuned for more articles that you should know about.